Hey, this is Mike at Mac Digital Media, and I have another workflow tip for you. Actually, this is really kind of a bug that I've discovered uh, in Adobe Premiere, the most recent update. This is version 14, build 116. Um, uh, anyway, today's date is uh, Friday, May 8th, 2020. And uh, maybe you've encountered this. I did when I was working on um, another project. Uh, it, what I found was, <laughs> I was going to type in this text fly, you know, F L Y, and using Minion Pro, which is, I believe, one of the uh, default fonts for Adobe. This is an Adobe font, too. It's not one of my own fonts that might have a font conflict or anything like that. As far as I can tell, this has an issue in Premiere in the Essential Graphics um, panel. As you can see, I mean, I'm just typing two separate. Two separate letters, yet they're, it's acting as if it's one, and that's not going to work, obviously, because you this the kerning is way too tight, and you can't even see the letters; they're not correct. I also found that you you do run in this same problem if you pick like F L for Florida or F F I or for P five Fo Fum or whatever. You know, it's still it's still mixed, it's still tight in there. I think even T has a problem too. FT, you know, so obviously that's not supposed to work that way. And you're supposed to see here when you have two letters, two or more letters, and you highlight them, you're supposed to be able to even do the kerning between it or just singly. Actually, I, I believe it's probably only once it's, I take that back, I think it's once you select the space between and then you can alter the, uh, the kerning between the letters you don't actually select it that would be in the case if you were to do one of these other ones so uh, but as you can see there is no space that it's giving me between F and T and F and I and F and L that kind of thing so there's no way to kern it um, so I tried everything to see is there any other way that we could could do this to fix it and there really doesn't seem to be so I filed a bug report with Adobe today to tell them about the situation. The only way that I can see that you'd fix it, and this is how you would fix similar kind of problems when you had, if you had kerning issues, or if you had just some sort of symbols or things that things that you were trying to uh, bring together, um, you know, correctly. This is the workaround in Essential Graphics panel. As you see, when you make the text, it it creates a layer each time that you do it, and you can do different layers in Essential Graphics tab. Uh, a panel just like you can in Photoshop you can have multiple layers so the way to get around this was what I did here is I just went ahead and duplicated uh, you know I can show you here if we if we clear this and we want to make so you can just take this duplicate it so that you don't have to worry and drag it down to the bottom that's what I ended up doing um, duplicate it so it's you know the same font size same you know, same other features that you'd have, and then you type in uh, the, the other two letters here, FL, uh, you know, FLY in this case, and what you would then do is you can separate these by just moving the position, here I'm changing the position right here, and then you would just essentially, uh, you know, line it up like you would, uh, you can also change then the uh, you know the kerning in this case this is where kerning is working correctly between these two characters and then you do it that way uh, and then you can you can still move this around if you wanted to do some sort of a drift on it or move or fly it in fly it in or something like that you can just still treat it as one group and you don't have to worry about manipulating individual layers that type of thing so uh, anyway I just figured I'd, I'd throw that out to you. I ran into that situation myself. Uh, just so you know, uh, Minion itself, uh, the regular font Minion, it works fine. Uh, I tried it with some other uh, sans serif fonts like Helvetica and uh, Arial, those, you know, Impact, it is sans serif kind of font. And there was no issue with those particular characters. It's only in Minion. Also tried a serif font uh, like, um, uh, times and uh, and it was fine it didn't have the same kind of issue so it just seems to be with minion pro anyway maybe that little workaround will help you hopefully uh, if you have to deal with 
Minion or if you uh, run into any other similar kind of issue with any other font that you use, hopefully that can help. Anyway, have a great day. Take care.